Zando is this abacus is it's not I just only the calculation I am teaching. I'm teaching the method of the how they should be respect to others and also how they should be respected. My student only learning from Abacus and Anzang, but I believe I am teaching beyond that point. So it's more spiritual to me. That I'm more disciplined to them. Uh, I think from his experience with Abacus, what he knows is that the more efforts he makes, the uh, more changes he can have in, in the results of anything he's been working on. So um, karate is another thing that requires a lot of discipline, and he's been doing well. And I think that uh, Abacus experience uh, taught him how to be patient and how important it is to repeat uh, some simple skills. If, you know, there are some parents who uh, think that they can put their kids in a more competitive environment for acquiring mathematical knowledge, I think Abacus is it. Abacus is going to be very helpful uh, for their kids to become more um, knowledgeable about mathematics and also be able to more um, become more able to focus on things. At school, when, when, the, when the child is already ahead of everybody else, there is a sense of confidence. You can't beat that. Um, you want to start your child's early education while she's very confident and eager. And Jams gets her there, at least with my child, Jams gets her there. She, it gives the confidence, it, it gives the motivation to do, learn even better so she can be even more ahead of the game. Um, it, it, it's, it's, it's a complete package for the child. It keeps her confident for the parents. It gives them the relief that she's on the right path for her career. I think it's one of the most remarkable things I've actually witnessed. Um, she started when she was four, and at that age, you know, there's a little bit of um, time to sit down 30 minutes and focus, but within the two years span, she's tremendously improved on that. That's the first thing, and her math skills have, it's awesome to see her, and she's some, it's something that she, when the 30 minutes she sits down to work on it, you can see the progression from when she started, when we we're trying to teach her one plus one, one plus two. Right now she's doing her multiplication and it's it's something that I take pride in it that we invested in that in her and we'll see how far she's gone and she really loves it. So where my daughter is right now, she's in kindergarten going to first grade, she's way, way ahead of you know her level in math. And that's how I tell them. I say if you want to forego for about Ab Abacus or Anzen or Jams, you know, look at the opportunity that you're preventing your child from getting into. Come visit me to see all my advanced students, like a third grader to up to the eighth grader. They sit with me two hours, 120 minutes, non-stop. Who can do that? But my students, yes, they can. They can do because they are very disciplined and they are very well trained.